Beijing The People's Republic of China's largest capital city, situated in the northern part of China and is one of China's six ancient cities. Beijing is known for its modern architecture such as the Grand Forbidden City Complex and the Imperial Palace. However, it is also known for its major air pollution and smog problems as well as having heavy traffic congestion which all have a huge negative impact on the environment of Beijing. The city of Beijing consists of more than 20 million citizens. The number of people living in Beijing has grown by more than 44% since 2010, and the city itself has a growth rate of 20% per decade. If the population of Beijing continues to grow at this rapid pace, they will have a lack of housing, land and resources available to support their growing population. One of Beijing's main environmental problems is air pollution. The air in Beijing is so unsafe that it is recommended that people living in the city should rather stay indoors with an air purifier running and remain as motionless as possible. Beijing's manufacturing industries and millions of cars and buses that travel daily on the roads of the city all contribute to the city's crippling air pollution. But primarily, the most blame goes to the coal-burning electrical plants that power China's breakneck economic growth. China burns 47% of the world's coal. That's roughly the amount used by all other countries combined. Schools have even been advised to close at times based on the danger of leaving their homes. This showcases the severity of the city's air pollution problems. Beijing has lots of cancer villages. Cancer villages are residential areas that are surrounded by chemical plants or cold fire power plants. They are villages with soil and water supplies that are contaminated. These are villages where every other house has someone dying of cancer or some sort of respiratory problem. Another major problem is the amount of carbon dioxide emitted by cars in Beijing. Beijing had less than 100,000 cars on their roads and now there is more than 3.6 million. This has resulted in traffic delays, traffic noise, air pollution and congestion. In Beijing, at least 1,000 people are killed by a car every year. And without the reduction of motor vehicles, major problems will continue to accumulate for Beijing. Solutions that could be implemented to help Beijing with the environmental problems are using renewable resources and energies such as solar energy, wind energy and hydro energy. Renewable energy could drastically change the environment of Beijing as it helps to reduce climate change and provide substantial health and economic benefits. By using renewable energy sources like solar energy, Beijing would also reduce the dependence on fossil fuel gas and oil reserves which are becoming more expensive and difficult to find. It will also reduce the dependence on imported fossil fuels, improving the energy security, and that's why renewable resources could help Beijing reduce its environmental problems. Other solutions that could be implemented to assist the help of renewable resources and energies to Beijing's environmental problems are using alternative methods for transportation other than everyone driving their own cars. These solutions would be walking, riding bicycles, and utilizing trains and buses to travel to work, school, and any other destination within the city. These alternatives will help people and families to reduce the amount of money spent on petrol. It will drastically reduce carbon emissions, improve health, which means cutting down on medical costs, relieving traffic congestion and noise. The solutions mentioned might seem like minor solutions that could not help, but they definitely will. It might take a bit long, but eventually changes in the environment will be seen, and as long as the solutions are followed, the changes and impacts of it will grow and show positive results. Then Beijing will return to being the city loved by all its citizens and enjoyed by all its tourists.